lot of times in a short roll, you have an advantage. And, you know, it's trying to figure out what that advantage is as fast as you possibly can. And to me, that's what the biggest trigger is, you know, in the short roll. You know, the defense is going to make a move and your your job is to react, you know, off the defense. I can almost, uh, you know, know what pass to make or know what play to make based on, you know, what defender's coming and where the, what, what the weak side is or or how we're defense they're playing. I already kind of anticipate, you know, what the pass is going to be and what that next pass is going to be. And a lot of that's just becoming from, you know, experience. Kind of look at almost like a, a quarterback in football. You know, the quarterback kind of looks at his progressions and it's like, okay, my primary target is A, but I know if A's not open, then I can look for B. And I'm up looking at option B, then I'm looking at option C. So for me, you know, we do a lot of four corner spacing. So I kind of know where everybody's going to be on the floor. So I know that, you know, if I roll to the middle, a lot of times it's it's either they're going to bump one or two spots, either they're going to bump from the, the three quarter man or they're going to bump from the weak side, or they're going to help from the, the weak side man, the weak side defender in the paint. So those are always my first two looks. I look at it and I'm looking at option A, option A is not there, well option B has to be there, option C has to be there. So that's the way I kind of look at it. I always And I always kind of call it like progressions, like I'm just looking for my progressions and kind of figuring out, you know, who's open based on what the defense is giving me. You have to shoot it, you know, at least once or twice, you know, a game just to kind of, you know, keep the defense honest. Um, you know, even if you miss both or even if you make both, I think it's going to hope open it up because if you don't look the shooter, if you don't even look at the basket as a defender, it's like, well, why do I have to, you know, get out there and play him if he's not going to, you know, make the attempt?